On News Channel 5 this morning, we're getting a sneak peek at the creations heading to the Wilson County Expo Center. Good for kids of all ages. It this is. sounds awesome. Rick Universe is bringing Lego fans and vendors to town. And Hannah McDonald talked to a first time vendor about the hobby. He's now turning into a business. And this took probably about three days to build it. It's probably got about 2,000 pieces. Willie Neblett enjoys Lego art so much, he's making it his business. They always tell you to do what you love work what you love and it's not like work. And then there's a gate door here. You could always use gates. Willie recognized Lego builders are often looking just for pieces. This is a uh, Ninjago legacy set. We would take something like this and use the pieces that's in here and just make it into something totally different. So he's collecting new, intricate, and in some cases, rare sets for his new online store, Titan Bricks Toys and Collectibles. And we're putting stuff on there all the time. This weekend, Brick Universe returns to the Wilson County Expo Center. It drew about 4,500 people last March. A list of renowned Lego artists are bringing displays, including cityscapes and life-size sculptures. Willie travels with Brick Universe and says he's inspired every time. It's very exciting, especially if it's in the theme that I like. When those come out, I'm ready to go spend all the money. <laughs> this will be Willie's first time as a vendor, and he's hopeful he's got a business that's built to last. In Madison, I'm Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5. How about that hat? That was pretty cool. Tickets for Brick Universe are $15 if you buy them online or $18 at the door.